Hello everyone, Flyboy here again. Up next in our how-to series of videos, we're going to fix a clogged printhead on the new Micro M 3D printer. Nothing will extrude from the nozzle, so it needs to be fixed. It's a pretty easy job, but we will need a couple tools to do so. First, we're going to need a flathead screwdriver, a very small size, and also we're going to need a Torx bit driver. Again, very small size. Mine's in an eight-piece set. Yours can be however you have it. First, we're going to take our flathead screwdriver and pop off the front black printhead cover. I'll let you take a look at the cover here. And that will reveal the white guide cover underneath. We're going to need to remove that cover to get to the clog. So we will take our Torx bit driver and remove the nickel colored screw on the front of the white guide cover. We're just going to back it out here. A few rotations is more than enough. And now that it's hanging there in place, I'm going to take my flathead screwdriver and just pop it out. And then I'm going to collect it and set it aside in a very safe spot. You don't want to lose it. Next, the flathead screwdriver will be used to pop off the white guide cover, revealing the gears inside. I'll set that to the side so you can see it clearly. Now, our gears inside, as you can see, the clogged filament between them. We're going to probably have to heat up the nozzle to get out that piece of filament. So let's go over to the M3D software and we'll go down to remove filament externally and click that. Now the printhead's already up, so all we have to do is hit remove filament. That will heat up the nozzle. It takes a minute or two. And now that it's warmed up, you'll start to see the gear here spin. And that will uh, tell you easily it's hot. And we're going to pop out this little piece. As I can see, it's just stuck in there so gently. And you can see the filament there all kind of crinkled up. Next, we're going to take the, Phillip, or the flathead screwdriver and push that piece of filament. It's stuck in the nozzle in between the gears. That will help pull it out with the right amount of force. And now you can see it start to pop up under its own power there. We're going to take and grab it out. And there it is. The printer is now unclogged. Now we're going to need to reassemble. Get any excess bit off the nozzle, as you can see. Now we're going to take our white guide cover and put it back into place. We want to make sure we don't pinch any wires in the, the print head in between there. So be very careful. And then we'll take our nickel colored Torx screw and put it back into the hole. like so. Now that that's there, we will take our Torx bit driver and a few rotations we'll tighten it up. You don't want to over tighten this. Just finger tight. And presto. Next, we'll take our black print head cover and snap it back into place, completing the process. And that's all it takes. Now you're ready to load a new print, some more filament, and give it another go. 
I'd like to thank you all for watching this video. If you found it helpful, please like or subscribe, and I hope to see you back again in the future. Goodbye.